different techniques on doing like messy buns and stuff but I came across this technique from I think a different tutorial and it's been my go-to every single time like this is the only way I do my messy buns now and it's always gonna give you this like full messy bun you know just thing going it's pretty simple if you guys want to see how I did it just keep watching Okay guys, so I started with kind of wavy hair because this never works with straight hair, but I just made sure there was no tangles in it. And you're going to need a couple scrunchies for this look. I used three and a bunch of bobby pins. Like a bunch. <laughs> so uh, now that your hair is tangle free and has a little bit of body to it, um, you're going to grab around the crown section I think that's the crown just like the you know upper section I don't know what I was listening to <laughs> and you're gonna grab a scrunchie and make kind of like a loop and tie your hair tie around it once and then you're gonna go ahead and grab the right side of your hair and go around that once after you combine it with the loop and then do the same thing on the other side. So at this point that first scrunchie should get pretty tight. As you can see I kind of struggled but you want to make sure it's tight so that the sides don't look like they're falling over. So then you're going to grab a second scrunchie and section off about half of the remaining amount of hair. So like the second, I guess, section and combine it with that huge messy situation <laughs> you have on top. You wanna make sure there's no bumps on the sides either. So it kind of just looks like you did it like once instead of three times. <laughs> So it's time for the third hair tie. I use kind of like a looser hair tie for this. And I grab the last little section and flip it right over what you have already. Just smooth out the sides, make sure everything is intact, <laughs> and secure it. I do about twice. Wrap it around twice and you kind of end up with that. It's a huge beehive going on. So you grab a bobby pin and you just want to go around and pin down so it kind of like is like a neat messy bun, whatever that means, but you guys know what I mean. So I'll take a couple bobby pins and I'll kind of uh, flip them apart so they're a little wider, kind of like a U-shaped pin, and I feel like those hold a little bit better. They don't really reject, so I put those in as well. So just keep going around until it looks how you want it. And I use anywhere from like 5 to 10 bobby pins when I do this look and I literally just put them anywhere I feel like I want it to hold. Ooh, that hair though. <laughs> and then you want to make sure your baby hairs are out and popping. Usually I'll use some edge control but this day I just use my fingers and pull out the sides. The struggle <sighs> and if you mess up any part of your bun you can just pin it and 
then just grab a little bit of hairspray just to make sure everything stays in place all day. So there you have it. A messy bun. I hope you guys really like this tutorial. Thanks for watching.